Unlike many mortgages, HELOCs are a kind of adjustable rate mortgage. HELOC rates have two components, a set base rate, or a margin, and a fluctuating rate, the index. Each month, the HELOC lender will calculate your payment based on your current balance and the combination of these two components to determine your rate. The lender will use your credit score and the amount of equity you have in your home as the basis of the margin for your HELOC. As soon as you have your HELOC lender, they will run a single report from all three major credit bureaus, namely Equifax, TransUnion, and Experian. Basically, they will merge your credit history that they have extracted from the three sources. This report will incorporate all your past credit history and your credit scores from each bureau. Most lenders usually pick the average of the three scores, although the conservative ones might use the lowest of the three scores. The rule is, the higher your credit score, the lower your HELOC margin will be. Negative information such as late payments or credit problems can cause you to have a higher margin. In some cases, applicants lose their eligibility for a HELOC simply because of the severity of their derogatory credit history. You can compute your home equity by dividing the total outstanding loans by your home's value. Take note that most lenders would want to see that your total loans do not exceed 90% of your home's value. The lower this percentage is, the lower your HELOC margin will be, and vice versa. So, looking at this principle, your margin can be practically as low as zero, but it can also be as high as a few percentage points if you have a credit issue and very low equity. That's it for now. On our website, you can find more posts and podcasts, as well as calculators and other financial tools. Do you have other ways to get the best and lowest HELOC rate? We would love to know your thoughts, so feel free to share them in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to our podcast channel on YouTube, and we will see you next time.